hey you guys welcome back to my channel so today I am going to attempt to do a DIY project I uh, I saw something online on some makeup organization website and they had a bamboo acrylic organizer and uh, you know we found the bamboo cutting boards at Dollar Tree and I have been trying to think of a way to use them and so this is what I'm going to do my inspiration came from that website and so I'm going to try to you know put my own little twist to it and show you guys what I'm doing I am also going to take it a step further and try to make this rotate <laughs> yes spin uh, if you guys remember what has it been two years I don't remember but a few years ago I did the rotating makeup tower and that was a really good video that I did and I used a different way to rotate um, the rotating mechanism from Dollar Tree this time I'm gonna do something different so I'm not gonna do too much talking I'm just gonna show you guys what I'm doing I am using six of the stackable organizing drawers on the top whatever you want to use you can but I'm using one of the one of these because you can put like fingernail polishes and stuff in here if you'd like and then I was going to use two of these and you'll see why on the top but then I'm just going to use one of these little acrylic trinket trays because I was thinking once I'm done you'll see that you know you can put jewelry or whatever you want in there I'm also going to be using four of the bamboo cutting boards and three soda tops yes three soda tops you will see why and a fidget spinner uh, to secure everything I do have some E6000 glue um, I do have some more and I will also be using my hot glue gun which you will see so I'm going to go ahead and stop talking uh, everything is pretty much it, it's super simple once you see I start um, and I'm gonna stop talking throw some music on and let's see what I come up with okay so as you saw I just went ahead and glued the cabinets together or the drawers together uh, I could have used the E6000 glue but I don't think it's necessary so I just went ahead and used the hot glue gun um, and so I have those six together now we are going to start doing the bottom part which is going to make the whole cabinet rotate so this is one of the old um, uh, fidget spinners that Dollar Tree used to sell if you cannot get one in Dollar Tree because I haven't been seeing them lately but if you can't get one you can check 99 cent store or any kind of little cheap little dollar store they usually carry these super cheap so what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to hot glue gun this bottom part and I'm gonna use enough and that's going to be right here in the center of this bottom part so I'm just gonna press that down and that will be on there like that okay so then I am going to glue these onto here so they'll be like that
just give it a good push like that. So once it's done, you will have a rotating mechanism. It doesn't have to just be for this, but this was what I came up with. So now, to get this one here, you will glue right here around the edges. And you probably want to move a little fast so they don't get all dried up before you get them all done. And then you just put that on top and you want to make sure you can kind of see that it's center. And that is on there like that. And I'm not going to mess with it. I'm going to let it dry a little bit. And as you can see in there, right there, that's what it will look like. But you won't see in there because, I mean, you're just going to be looking at it from this way. You're not going to be looking under here. So as you can see, it'll rotate. How cool is that? <laughs> so I'm going to finish this up and you guys will see how it looks at the end. So now that I have both the sides on like this, look at that, that is so cool. Um, I need one more on the top. So now that that is done, now this is where the option is up to you. If you want, you could actually take this out and glue this inside of here so that this whole set doesn't come out. Uh, I'm choosing to leave it like this in case I want to take it out, maybe clean it, I don't know. But I'm, I'm not going to glue this down. But you can take those out if you'd like. And as you can see, it rotates perfectly fine. Um, and then what you can do is put this on top and glue that down as well. Okay, you guys, and this is the finished product. Now, I will suggest that you go through and use the E6000 glue. I just kind of was doing, um, I don't know. I was just experimenting to see if this was actually going to work. I do recommend using not just the the hot glue on the wood pieces but also the e6000 just so that nothing you know falls apart eventually i hope you guys enjoyed this you guys know how i am with my diy projects i never really know what i'm doing i just do it and yeah so all right you guys i will talk to you in my next video bye